It's cold, winter's here, let's keep our children's immune system strong this flu season. I am a doctor, alhamdulillah, I'm also a pharmacist. Now I understand the human body and I understand medications and trust me, I'm not here to offer you any certain campaigns what other healthcare professional is offering every flu season. I'm here to keep it natural. Let me tell you the best foods and supplements which you could consider for your child. Asalaamu Alaikum, my name is Dr. Adnan Azad and with flu season here, every parent is looking for ways to keep their child healthy. The general rule is if they don't fall sick, we don't fall sick. Alhamdulillah, thank God, there are so many simple research-backed strategies that can help. I am looking at key foods and supplements that can strengthen your child's immune defences, keeping them nice and strong, keeping them well throughout their school years. Let's start with the basics, their diet. A healthy, balanced diet is a foundation of a strong immune system. You cannot be reaching out for supplements over the counter when your child's diet is based around junk food. So what should you be incorporating? Number one, fruits and vegetables. We've all heard it, eat your veggies. A variety of colourful fruits and vegetables are packed with vitamins that are known to boost your immunity. For example, vitamin C in oranges, bell peppers and strawberries can actually help reduce the severity of colds. Now have this in moderation and boom, you've got your natural recommended intake of vitamin C. Number two, probiotics. Fantastic gut health plays a big role in immunity. Simply put, probiotics found in yogurt and fermented foods are classed as good bacteria that keep your child's gut in balance. And it's widely known, a healthy gut means a stronger immune system. A paediatric study found that kids who consume probiotics daily had fewer respiratory infections throughout the year. Now is that a coincidence? You can decide. Number three, increase the amount of protein within your child's diet. Now protein is not just for people trying to build muscles in the gym. It helps to build immune cells too. So incorporate protein within your diet. Foods like chicken, beans, fish are rich in zinc, which is very important for fighting off infections and recovering quickly. So there's your zinc intake. Number four, hydration. Very simple. This is always missed and it's super important. Water helps every system in your child's body function as it should. Keep them drinking water throughout the day. You can top that by adding hydrating foods like watermelon and cucumbers for a boost. Now foods to avoid. Again, I will keep it very simple. Avoid this one thing, sugar. So many studies prove that sugar weakens the immune system by suppressing white blood cell activity for hours after eating. Avoid junk food where possible. If you don't have junk food in the house, you're child simply will not ask for it. Out of sight, out of mind. Of course, they're allowed a treat here and there, but it does not have to be part of their daily diet. So swap out the sugary snacks, the crisps, the chocolates, all made to weaken your child and instead opt for healthier options like nuts, seeds or fruit to keep their immune system strong and healthy. Right, here we are. Diet's been ticked off. It's balanced. Your child's getting the right nutrients, helping them to thrive through this flu season. Now let's look at some supplements that can help support your child's immunity. Let's start with the sun sunshine vitamin, vitamin D. Now this is crucial, especially during the winter period here in the UK. Sunlight is limited. You hardly see it. Vitamin D is known to help regulate your immune system and lowers the risk of respiratory tract infections. In fact, a recent study found that kids with enough vitamin D had 50% lower risk of getting sick. The recommended dosage for kids aged 1 to 12 is 400 to 600 international units daily. Zinc is another key player for immunity. It helps produce immune cells and shortens the duration of colds and flu. But be careful with dosages as too much zinc can cause stomach upset. So for kids who are aged 4 to 8, safe amount is 5 milligrams daily. For kids who are aged 9 to 13, it's 8 milligrams daily. Again, check with your pharmacist and check with your doctor before starting anything new. Now, probiotic supplements. If your child isn't into yogurt or probiotic rich foods, supplements might be the way forward. They do support good health and, and boost immune response. Look for supplements with 5 to 10 billion CFUs. CFUs is, is just short for colony forming units and choose child friendly formulas. And of course, please, always consult your doctor or pharmacist before giving your child any new supplements. I'm just here to give you the advice. It's your job to make sure it's right for you to take. That's it. And it's as simple as that. By focusing on a balanced diet, cutting out the nasties, adding some key supplements, you can help your child stay healthy and resilient during this winter flu season. If you found this helpful, please don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe, and please leave a comment below. I'll be responding to as many as I can. Take care, and inshallah, I will see you for the next video. Asalaamu Alaikum.